Patients have always received personalized care from their physicians, but increasingly as science evolves, we're able to tailor therapies to patients. This is incredibly important so that patients can make the right decision about which medicine is best for them. And as the science of heterogeneity of treatment effect evolves, patients will have more information to make more informed decisions. There are biologic and non-biologic factors that affect the way in which a medicine works in a patient. If you think about children, we know that the height of a child sometimes is affected by genetics, but it's also affected by what they eat and other factors which are non-biologic. The same is true for the way in which medicines work. Some things are genetics, and some things are about the way in which a patient behaves, whether they smoke, how much they eat, and the types of food. And all of these factors will affect how a treatment responds in that patient. Therefore, it's important for a physician and a patient to understand how these factors interrelate so that we can get the right medicine to each patient, and they can also adjust their lifestyle accordingly. But we oftentimes don't know the entirety of what could affect how a medicine interacts with a patient's body and whether or not that patient will respond to the medicine. And so I do think it's important for us to talk to expert clinicians and also to talk to patients about their own experiences so that we can have new hypotheses to be tested in future research. It's incredibly important for us to get information that comes out of research to patients in a way that they can understand. The government is very interested in doing that and part of healthcare reform is making sure that when we produce new research, that we translate it so that not only physicians, but their patients can understand it. That's a major policy implication, and it means that the government will have to spend new monies to make sure that we translate information so that the right information gets to patients and helps them to make better decisions.